Do all natural cleaning products actually work? Let's talk about that. Good Mythical Morning! If you watched El Tat this past weekend, you saw the teaser for the ultra top secret Mythical Society, which is gonna offer access to an unprecedented layer of mythicality. It's all very exclusive, it's all very hush hush, mm -hmm. but you can be poised to join us by signing up for info now at mythicalsociety.com. Yeah, the Mythical Society is a super secret society, but one thing that's not so secret is that I have the tiniest, faintest, most minuscule touch of OCD. <laughs> it's Rhett's favorite thing about me. We mm. never argue about it. Mm -hmm. And as a person who likes to keep things clean and be clean, I have amassed a particular expertise on cleaning products. Which is why, Link, you should know that according to the American Lung Association, a lot of the cleaning products you use contain chemicals that can cause headaches and other health problems. Mm. But there's a lot of other chemical-free alternatives available. The question is, are they better than the popular name brands? It's time for Free. We've devised a series of dirty situations in order to pit name brand chemically cleaners against some plant-based chemical free alternatives, but the thing is, we don't know which one is which. Based on their cleaning performance alone, we're going to guess which one is chemical free, and if we get less than three correct, we have to clean Craig's snake cage on Instagram. Oh gosh. Let's get to cleaning. Round one. We're kicking things off with two all-purpose cleaners. One of these is 409, and the other one is the all-natural plant-based all-purpose cleaner, Puracy, mm. which I thought was poo racy for a, <laughs> for a little bit of time, <laughs> but it's not. Uh, now all we need is just purpose. Yes, and here it is, the exploded remains of an enchilada heating session. Oh, good gosh. He exploded the door right, right off okay. in the front. We, we broke the microphone. <laughs> just kidding. Did that just happen or? <laughs> that just happened. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Good All right. Gosh. So I'm going to take this side. We've got some paper that is towels. horrifying. This reminds me of when I open the door after my kids use the microwave. How hard is it to do a paper towel drape, kids? Oh, you no. do paper towel drape at your house? Uh, I, I don't just do paper towel drape. I have like a. I have a whole. Now don't hit my side, okay? I'm not. I have a. Um, uh, what the plastic thing you put over the top? Oh, you got a fancy, fancy. A <laughs> fancy, yeah. I just use a paper towel drape. Oh gosh, that kind of stinks. Is it the cleaner or the? <clears throat> is it the mixture of the two cleaners, or is it the enchilada? Both of them smell like they could be uh, chemically, honestly, based on. Oh gosh, this is. You know what's making this even worse? The fact that I got that high school musical song in my head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, this isn't just a session that just happened. This is like, this is a session from several days ago. Um, Good God. I would just throw it out at this point, honestly. <laughs> I'm really regretting saying, make sure it's really dirty. I don't want this to be easy. <laughs> Oh gosh. Let's just, you know, we're, let's just throw this away. Okay, take that out. I mean, I feel like I'm having better luck on my side. Put some elbow grease into the back there and see what, see what you can do. See if you can dislodge some of that. Yours is not really moving. <coughs> okay, so I may be wrong. Stinks. I may be wrong, but I can't. I, am, I, am I just like, Biased opinion, <laughs> uninformed opinion. I would think the thing, the, the ones with the bad chemicals, would probably be better at cleaning. You'd yeah. be compromising a little bit when you go with the friendly one. And I think mine was doing a better job than yours. So I think that you have the pu the poo racy. Yeah, you got the poo racy on your side. I agree. So Stevie, that's our answer. That I have the puracy, and this is the four hundred nine. So over okay. here. Okay, the all natural cleaner is on. Link side. <laughs> okay. Yes. We're off to a good start. Too racy. I think we're just gonna have to chuck this, guys. Round two. Next up, we have window cleaners. Uh, one of these is Windex, and the other is all natural. Better life. They're both blue. Um, we've also got these windows here covered in bird poop, 
or as I like to call it, sky pudding. <laughs> you might be wondering why it's not white, and it turns out, unless you own a bird, you can't just collect bird poop. It ain't right. that easy. Uh -huh. Uh, we asked Chase to stand outside with his mouth open for days. Nothing happened. Right. So we got the next closest thing. This is bat poop. Right. We asked Chase to live in a cave for a week, and he did that. <laughs> <laughs> Scraping it up. Guano. Okay, so uh, all your mess on your side is on the front. All my mess on my side is on the back, so we don't get this overspray situation. Okay. Um, how did the bat get on the inside and outside of the window in crap like it this? Was two, it was two lover bats that were trying to connect with each other. One was on the inside, one was on the outside, and they kept missing each other. But having to use the bathroom. When bats get excited, they guano everywhere. Oh yeah, look at this. I mean, just the first pass here, I'm getting some good results. Uh, I'm, getting, I'm getting some good smear. You're getting a lot of smearage. I'm gonna give it another. What, you just don't spray me. Did I spray you? Yes. And I don't know which one you got, man. Now All keep right. in mind, are you doing a double spray? Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna spray again. The don't, we'll leave it at that. The all-natural one is more expensive, a couple dollars more expensive for the bottle. Uh, so you're actually paying more for the, for, for the. You know, this is start, kind of starting to work, but still getting. Fair amount of streakage. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take one more paper towel while you do the same and just wipe it down and we'll take a look. Well, a lot of this is just from this, this overspray that oh. I, I got from, from you. Okay, yeah, let's get rid of that. And you can get off the overspray. Okay. Yeah, okay, so now we've got a We've got a good comparison, right? Mm, pretty close. I mean, your side is definitely cleaner. It may just be because you were more meticulous. It may not have anything to do with the, uh, with. but yours seemed to dissolve faster and yeah. earlier. Yep. So I think that I have. Yours the, require more elbow grease. All natural, which has corn, coconut, and palm oil in it. Three really? of my favorite things. All right, Stevie, so this is our answer that Rhett has better life. I have better a better life. I have a better life. <laughs> The all natural cleaner is on Link's side. Uh, yeah. Really? You put a lot of elbow grease into that. Well, you probably should have watched both sides. Round three. So we've got Palmolive dish soap versus the all natural Mrs. Myers. And here we have a cooking pan that Josh has incinerated with lasagna. Good gosh. Actually, that's also a bat guano. It was an Italian bat. <laughs> this is horrifying. Typically this would be soaking for overnight and then hopefully someone else would come in and clean it because oh, I just forgot it was soaking kind of a thing. Right, but ain't nobody got time for that so we gonna just wet our sponges. Now your, so your soap is clear. Yep, and Mrs. Myers um, is, uh, is uh, essential oils. It, it relies on essential oils and it's actually cheaper. It's cheaper than palm olive, so. I mean, the sun, a, we don't have a lot of, just, you see, are you scrubbing? Well, You're I'm, not using the scrubbing side. Well, I'm, the first thing I'm doing is I'm just seeing if there's like a, I, I a, re, the a reaction that's taking place. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm on it to soak into everything. You seem to have more water in your sponge. And now, you can turn it and add a little bit of the elbow grease. I'm trying to do the same thing you're doing in the same order. A little elbow grease. Yeah, oh, we could be dishwashers dish. who work together and we divide all the dishes into half. <laughs> yeah. Have you Draw seen the line? You seen the you seen the dishwashing brothers? They each wash half. Try to get back here. When one of them's sick, you only get half clean dishes. But that one half is clean. So it's not doing anything to this super, super caked on. But in the middle, Mine's I feel good. like I, I've, I'm getting some cake off. I feel like I've got some serious things happening. Look at that sponge. Yeah, okay, it does it doesn't end up getting in there. Oh, this is this is gonna be a tough call. I feel like mine may be a little cleaner though. Look at that. Like when you go in, go in there with the soft part of your sponge and see what happens. Just kinda expose it. I don't know, that's pretty even. You just went on Good oh, oh, You crossed the line, dishwash I, brother. I wanted to clean the line. <laughs> Yeah, but you came a full sponge with, that's the, the only rule the dishwashing brothers have is that they don't cross the line. 
I'm just picking up your slack. That's not how the system works. When the boss is looking. Uh, I don't, I, see, I'm just see, gonna go on pure color. I think that Palm Olive is, is green. Right, right. <laughs> that's, much, all, that's all I got. We I think pretty they, much know that. But they, they work pretty evenly. We are voting that this Rhett's is Mrs. Mrs. Myers. Myers. The all natural's on Rhett's side. Yes. yes, okay. The green was a dead giveaway. But they clean pretty evenly. And Mrs. Myers is cheaper. I've always thought about uh, thought that about Mrs. Myers. She's so cheap. <laughs> Affordable. <laughs> Round four. Okay, for carpet cleaner, we've got Resolve versus the chemical free earthworm carpet and upholstery cleaner. And for the carpet, we have blood. What is it with you guys and blood? Do you really have that much blood lying around? I think they do. Is yes. it all from Chase? Okay. All right. So it's it's like a blood spray. So I don't I don't know how to clean carpet. You well, just spray you, this on. You 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 typically would spray it and then let it set for a while. I'm gonna kind of do this. I'm sort of working this back spot here. Yeah, you just get it nice and wet. Yeah. Got a lot of red right there. Okay. It gets kind of thin back here. And then what, dip this into some water? I'm really interested in this one because carpet cleaner seems to be like, at least in my opinion, very strong. You know, it's like the strongest smelling stuff, the most ruthless, because you don't eat it. You don't eat carpet, at least not usually. So you can, you can go a little bit more. You can go more aggressive with the chemicals, is what I'm saying. Right? Right, Link. The carpet cleaning boys. Oh, gosh. Now, this is a great workout. Bring us to your house, and as long as you draw a line down the middle of the room, we'll know what to do. <laughs> I just concentrated in this one spot. Yeah. It's, this is, um, this and, is uh, a tall order. I honestly, I don't... I don't know what I'm accomplishing. Yeah, I'm just trying to get one spot right now because I get... can look and tell that this is still very bloody. It's also smelling pretty strong. What kind of what kind of smells are you getting on your side, carpet brother? Uh nice. It smells like pork blood. <laughs> is that what it is? Pork blood? Yeah, gosh. Um, but I'm not smelling too much chemically chemical stuff. Um I think I just learned that I don't want to be a carpet cleaner. You know what? Mine smells a little chemically, and I mine became pink or pinkish white. Yours is still pretty red, and yeah. you've really been scrubbing. So I'm gonna say that my side is the natural, and if we if we're not right, then that means we have to clean up Craig's cage. So I think that this is the natural side. You agree? I thought she said yours smelled more chemically. Oh yeah, yeah. So this is more natural. So that's the natural side. Yep, I was yeah. thinking the same thing and saying the wrong thing. I agree Link with that. Link has the natural side for the win. The natural cleaner is on Rhett's side. Uh, we should have gone with my mess up in my mind. Well, neither one of them cleaned this up, so just throw out the carpet. Oh man, now we gotta clean Craig's cage. Go to our Instagram page to check that out. Uh, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Brady. I'm Erica. I'm Crew. I'm Kennedy. I'm and this is Lennon. And we're camping in a yurt in Island Park, Idaho. And, it, and it's and time, time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Looks like a hot tub with a door on it. That's pretty much what a yurt is. <laughs> Click the top link to watch us test the best disinfectant wipes in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is gonna land. Move at the speed of conversation with us. Subscribe to Ear Biscuits wherever you listen to podcasts.